With Firefox for mobile phones, we're bringing the same experience you're used to um, at your PC and bringing that to the mobile phone. When designing for mobile, you have to keep in mind how both parties in the interaction, the mobile device and the person, are, are different in a mobile context. Because the screen is so small, you shouldn't have to be looking at anything from Firefox itself. The controls live beyond the page edges. Just move left past the web page edge to see your other tabs, or to swipe past the right edge of the web page to see back and forward and bookmarking. The Awesome Bar is typically a place where you would just type in an unwieldy URL in your mobile device, but it also learns as you go. So the minute you start typing, it it suggests places that you're probably already looking for. This becomes especially handy when you're on your mobile, you're out and about, and you need to find what you're looking for and fast. And with Weave, it just gets all that more powerful. What we're working on is a way to synchronize all of your browsing between your desktop and your mobile phone seamlessly. So if you've been using your browser on a PC, you can take that history that you've built up and seamlessly transfer it to your mobile phone in the background. So you could be at your desk um, on your favorite site. Oh, something comes up, you have to leave. You leave. Later, you pull your phone out of your pocket, and boom, you can pull those sites up immediately so we're creating a seamless transition between desktop and mobile phone. Location aware browsing is a pretty cool feature in Firefox allowing you to share your location with a website without having to enter an address or a zip code. For instance if you go to a new place or a new city and don't have any idea what's around and need driving directions you can instruct Firefox to share your location with a website getting anything from driving directions to seeing pictures of the area around you to finding out what live events are in the area. Security and privacy are two of the most important things about Firefox. So if you want to, to grant access to a website to be able to provide more relevant services based on where you are, you can do that and you're in control of your privacy. And another thing that we're bringing to Firefox on mobile devices, which is brand new first in the market, is the ability to have browser add-ons. So add-ons are, are little pieces of functionality that make the browser look and behave the way you want it to. What we're attempting to do with Firefox on the phone is to provide the same rich development platform we provided on the desktop. We have all the latest HTML5 features so that web developers can access the rich capabilities of the device and be able to provide rich experiences written in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript just like on the desktop. So over time we see the web being a viable platform for great application development that rivals that of native applications.